Hi everyone! Welcome back to another video. Um, for today, we will do um, a Samonte Kitchen Monsi episode and we're going to cook a quick and easy pasta dish. Um, umuulan ngayon, it's a Saturday and sabi nila, light to moderate rains daw. So, ang gagawin natin is since hindi tayo makakapamalengke or as much as possible, kailangan natin ubusin kung ano yung nasa ref fridge natin, refrigerator natin, eh, gagawa na lang tayo ng quick and easy pasta dish. So, ito yung mga nakuha ko sa fridge. And ito yung mga ingredients na meron ako sa pantry. So, alika. So, for the ingredients, um, nakakita ako ng 500 grams well, dalawang 250 grams na pasta, spaghetti. Nakakita ako ng apat na tomatoes. Ito, binili ko to sa basil. 52 pesos. Parang ito is 24 pesos. Tapos, meron tayong Montano, Montano sardines. Um, galing ito sa Dipolog. Tama ba? Chi? Yes, galing ko sa Dipolog. Um, ito yung lagi namin pinapapasalubong pag pupunta sa probinsya si Isa, yung friend namin. So, this is in tomato sauce and corn oil. And we have butter. And we have crab paste. Tabanan talang ka. Navarros. Um, hindi na... Itong crab paste na to, um, this is around less than 200 pesos sa SM. And siguro naka tatlong luto na ako dito. And this time, mauubos na natin siya. Or uubusin na natin siya. So, tatlong dish na yung nagawa ko dito for less than 200 pesos. Ito namang Montano sardines. Um, nasa 100 pesos to. Isang bottle. 120 ata. Tama? Parang mga ganon. So, naka... Tignan nyo, oh, medyo paubos na. So, ito lang yung gagawin natin sa hog para matanggal na natin sa fridge. And then, yung butter, uh, matagal na rin yan. Yung basil, kabibili ko lang yan. So, salt and pepper to taste. And kung ano pa yung makikita natin sa um, pantry, yun ang gagamitin natin. So, first, since this is a quick and easy dish, papakuluan muna natin tong pasta noodles. So, the water is boiling already. And we're just waiting for it to boil talaga para ma mabilis maluto yung noodles. So right now, iluluto natin or ipe-prepare natin yung mga gagamitin natin for the sauce. For the ingredients, um, roughly chop the tomatoes. As in, cut it in half and then to six, um, six slices, pahaba. And then for the basil, um, you need to make sure that the basil is washed and then roughly chopped it again. Um, iwan yun na yung mga stems, yung malalaking stems, pero yung mga maliliit na stems, pwede na yan. Kasi malalanta naman yan dun sa ating niluluto. So, every, yung lahat ng ingredients yan, roughly chopped lang lahat yan. Hi! So, medyo mainit na yung ating... Um, water for the noodles and ako naman, naglalagay lang ako ng salt. So, kumukulo na yung pasta natin and it looks cooked already. Um, hindi natin siya talagang lulutuin kasi nga ihahalo pa natin siya dun sa ating sauce mamaya. At this point, dito ko nilalagyan ng oil yung pasta to make sure na hindi magdidikit-dikit yung pasta noodles natin. And then, once the oil is all spread out dun sa noodles natin, nilalagyan ko siya ng cold water or ng running water 
And then, para uminit at tumigil yung cooking time ng pasta natin. And to make sure na yung pasta natin will stay al dente. Now for the sauce, um, olive oil, syempre, or vegetable oil. And then I added butter. Um, bago matunaw yung talagang butter, I added the sardines or yung ating Spanish-style sardines. And then dinurog ko siya. Once the sardines are almost cooked, nilagay ko na yung chopped basil natin and yung tomatoes natin. Uh, make sure at this point of the cooking, yung basil natin is makoat ng oil at ng sauce ng sardines natin. And maaamoy ninyo na mag nagkok nagsasama-sama na yung mga lasa. And then, after that, nilalagay ko na yung alige natin. Huli ko siyang nilalagay. And, ayan na. Kung makikita ninyo, hahalo yung alige dun sa oil. And then, I added Delimondo chili oil, some sesame oil, and garlic. Medyo madami ako mag-garlic kasi gusto ko yung lasa nun. And yung sa oil and garlic, sobrang okay sa akin yung taste ng combination ng dalawa. Plus yung alat pa nung noodles natin and nung mga sardines at nung taste ng basil, nagko-complement talaga yung lasa nila sa isa't isa. Then I added a little bit of salt, just a pinch, para at least make sure ko na may konting alat. Kasi nga, this is technically a seafood pasta. And then, I added pepper. Now, all we have to do is just to make sure or to wait for the um, ingredients to incorporate or yung taste nila to incorporate. And then, I added the noodles. I folded the noodles dun sa sauce kasi ia-absorb ng noodles yung sauce na ginawa natin. Now, if your sauce is too um, konti, you can add a little bit of water. Kasi i-absorb din naman ng noodles natin yung water na yan. So, our pasta is already cooked. You can plate na lang natin siya dito sa ating bowl. So this is our finished product, our pasta alige or alige pasta, na very quick and easy. And etong pasta dish na to, yung ganito kadami, pwede to sa anim to six to ten persons. So as long as you have those ingredients sa loob ng fridge niyo, or you can own, also use yung mga ingredients na like for example yung Spanish sardines, tapos yung alige pa yung alige taba na talang ka. Um, pwede naman kayong yung cheapest lang yung bilhin ninyo or kung gusto niyo na medyo maanghang pwede kayong maglagay ng konting sile or kung gusto niyo maglagay ng shrimp pwede rin naman or yung mga mussels yung maglagay talaga maglagay talaga kayo ng seafoods pero for this time um, it's just a quick and easy pasta um alige pasta brought to you by sa Monte Kitchen Monsi <laughs> oh. Isigaw mo! Trap. <laughs> Nasang parang matinara ng peg niya. Thank you, thank you. Is it a thumbs up or a thumbs down? Harap dito. Enjoy this video and sana natutun may natutunan kayo sa video ko. And please don't forget to click like, share, and subscribe. And hope to see you on my next vlogs. Thank you. God bless. Top Konka.